Yo, what is up guys? Welcome to another Wild Rift video. And in today's video, I'll be playing Nasus. But firstly, I really want to show you how to build Nasus. So if you want to skip out the build part, you can just find timestamps in the video. You can literally just skip it around. So let's get into it. Nasus is a very interesting champion. He's very strong late game and very weak early game. So I'll be talking later on in the video during the live gameplay how to use that, but about the build. So you always, literally always, the best item on Nasus is trinity force trinity force is such an amazing item on nasus and i'm gonna tell you how you can get power spikes on nasus so first of all when you're building trinity force let me find that item which is called sheen uh here it is you want to get sheen first because sheen says using an ability causes the next attack used within 10 seconds to, build, to do bonus damage every time you use your first ability on nasus which has a very low cooldown you'll do bonus damage when you have sheen so when you get sheen you have a power spike and when you get trinity force you have a power spike so these are two power spikes that you want to utilize second i have spirit visage so this is a very interesting item because um nasus has healing like his passive grants him life gives him lifesteal and this increases the healing by 30 percent I mean, you, you want to go for this item if the enemy has magic damage, especially if the enemy uh, Baron Laner has magic damage, then you always want to go Spirit Visage second. But if, if the enemy doesn't have magic damage at all, you can also get Guardian Angel. Guardian Angel is also a really good item on uh, Nasus. So about the uh, boots, I got Mercury Stoneplate here. This item is really good if you want to be tanky in the enemies, but you can get different items as your boots. Stasis is good when stasis is good, you know, when you need to avoid damage. Locket Enchant when you need to give your team shield. I mean, it really depends. Like, as I said, I put Mercury Stoneplate here, but you can go anything on Nasus here, to be honest. So after that, I'm not going to be talking too much about these the last items because they're honestly situational i've put uh dead man's plate tormill here and iceborne gauntlet as some basic items so if you have no idea what to build you can just copy this build but basically you have to look at your enemy if they have a lot of magic damage you have to get magic resist of course you already have a spirit visage so that's already a lot of magic resist and um you can if they have a lot of uh, weapon damage or attack damage i should say you should get armor about the runes this is like the grasp of undying is the best rune on nasus this is by far the best rune you should go for him and you should in my opinion always go for gathering Sco storm because as i said nasus is a late game champion so you should get gathering storm so you can skill up to the late game after that i got hunter titan because uh, unique champion takedowns will give you tenacity and max health this is good for the late game because in the late game you're gonna start to take down more champions you know and i personally really like mastermind um because mastermind allows you to take down turrets very fast honestly you can also get sweet tooth sweet tooth is also really good because it will increase your healing from the from you know from the honey fruit and it will also give you gold so you should either go for sweet tooth or or mastermind depending on how you want to play like if you really want to split push hard on nasus and you know you're going to attack turrets and dragons and baron and stuff like that then you should get this one otherwise you should get the sweet tooth so yeah those are the first minutes talking about the build now i'll be showing you some live gameplay where i can give you tips and tricks on how to play nasus let's get to it all right so we're in a game by the way i'm playing with dianzio which is also another youtuber and i'm really happy to be playing with him so um yeah i'm playing nasus so as i said now i'll be giving you tips while playing nasus in the game so you can literally watch live how i play nasus and i'll also be giving you tips so as i mentioned before nasus is very weak early game so you have to be careful ward the blue oh you're a little too late bro a little too late i'm so sorry shivana he is right though i should have probably watered the blue so okay there's evelyn yeah okay like, as you can see okay i I should not mess with this Evelyn yet. But I want to tell you one thing. Nasus is actually really good into Evelyn. Like really, really good. But the only thing is, of course, Evelyn is insanely strong in the early game. So we just have to play it chill for now. And I need to get levels. So when I get like level 4 or 5. And when I get my Sheen. As I mentioned in the builds. You know, during the build part of this video. Be careful. When I get my Sheen, I, will, I might actually be able to kill the Evelyn. So as I said. You want to be playing safe on Nasus. So another thing that's important on Nasus is you you should always try to secure minions, kills, everything with your Q. Because when you secure... Oh my god, let's try to get this minion. Ah, whatever. Like, he's not dealing that much damage. I just need to dodge. Like, if I only get hit by one... Oh, there's Ari. They want to kill me in the early game. Yeah. So I got the honey fruit thing here in this game because I really need the healing because I'm against Evelyn. So I chose the honey fruit rune. Let's go for the minion. Yeah, I'm taking damage. He actually took a turret shot, which is good for me. I'm just, you know what I'm trying to do? Oh my God, that was stupid. Wait, this is bad. I'm trying to stay as healthy as I can while taking minions as well. I need to run, man. He's going after me. Shivana's coming. Wait, we can bait him. Shivana's coming. 
This should be a kill, right? I'm just baiting him? Let's slow him? Easy. Nice try, bro. Nice try. See, this is perfect. When you're playing jungle with a Nasus in your team, uh, there's a thing that you need to look at. Because the enemy is probably going to be very aggressive when they're playing against a Nasus. Because, you know, Nasus has to play passive and the enemy wants to bully Nasus as much as they can. So, as a jungler, you can actually gank the lane of the Nasus like my jungler just did, which was amazing. And now, now I have such a good advantage in my lane because Evelyn already died and I have an assist. So, should, I, I'm not going to push this out. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to secure with my Q. Boom. So I want you to look under my first ability. It says 16. That means stacks. 16 stacks. And the stacks give you bonus damage on your Q. Should I try to fight him? Let's actually try to fight him. I, I want to see how much damage I have. Boom. Come on. Ah, oh, I actually felt. Let's just take the means, whatever. I still can't fight him. But when I get level 5, I'm definitely going to be able to fight him. Oh, God. But... <laughs> These guys said in the draft that they're pre and they just filled hard. I'm taking too much damage here. Like, I made a mistake. You don't want to get poked like that. I just want to secure the main. Boom. As I said, like, just secure the main. Well, now I'm level 5. So if he overextends, I'm actually going to kill him. Like, I'm legit going to kill him. I'm going to hard dive him if he overextends here. He's just poking me, but he's playing very aggressive. I really want to punish him for it. Oh, I just filled my Q. Okay, so about the Q... Wait a second. I can get Sheen, by the way. Uh, I'm sorry. It's kind of hard to talk while I'm fighting, while I'm trying to fight this guy. He just keeps using his stupid first ability. Let's just stay here. Let's go. Boom. I'm going to fight. I'm going to fight. I can ult here. I can win this easy. I think I got the kill. Let's walk here. Boom. Okay, now I just won my lane. So when you... <laughs> now I just won my lane. Like, literally, if you kill the enemy as a Nasus, you literally won your lane. Like, right now, uh, it's... I don't, I don't want to say snowballing, but if I just manage to stay alive and keep stacking up my Q, I can just win this lane easy, and uh, in the late game, I can be a, an amazing tank for my team. So the point of Nasus is to scale up to late game and become a tank. Like, you only build tank items. Uh, you o The only damage item that you really build is Trinity Force and maybe Guardian Angel. Um... Damn, nice. The Shifana's doing good. After that, you just go for full tank. Let's get Sheen, of course. And we can actually get both. Now, I'm just super strong. Like, ah, um, yeah, I'm just going to destroy him. Hmm, let me see. So, um, the way that you want to draft Nasus as well is... It's good against burst champions. We win hard late. Let me just tell my team, you know, to motivate them a little bit. We just need to focus dragons and then we win hard late. What was I talking about? Yeah, Nasus is good against Burst, because you can just go for full defense. Um, there's also this item that I forgot to mention, which is Starex Gauge. My camera just froze, by the way. Let me just turn it off. I'm so sorry. My camera literally just froze. I'm so sorry. Yeah, okay. Screw my camera. Let's just focus on the game. I can get Trinity Force. Well, let's fight him anyways. I can just easily fight this guy. Boom. Look at this damage. I'm just gonna dive him. Ah, uh, no, I'm not. Wait, should I dive him? Ah, uh, I don't. I I really want to dive him. Like I can slow him and I can fight him. Okay, let's let's do it. Screw it. Boom. That's another kill. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh my god. So when you use your ult. Your ability cooldown gets lowered by 50%. So you can literally spam your Q and your other abilities. And the way that I upgrade my abilities on Nasus is, first of all, of course, I upgrade my Q. Or I, I'm saying Q, but I mean first ability with that. I upgrade my first ability first. And then I upgrade my second ability, which is the slow. Like, the slow is so incredibly strong, guys. The slow is so, so, so strong. And you should definitely upgrade it second. Uh, let me see. Let's just go to my lane. We're doing so good. I'm going to get Spirit Visage second item, by the way, because I'm against an Evelyn. So it's going to be an amazing item against him. I'm also stacking up my uh, my first ability very well. I already have 116 stacks. So when you get small minions, you get 4 stacks. And when you get big minions or jungle or the big jungle minions, you get 8 stacks. Also, when you get a turret, you get 4 stacks. And when you get an enemy kill, you get 8 stacks. You know, you need to know all about all that. Let's try to punish him for taking that minion. Boom. Look at this damage, though. I don't want to go too far because their jungler might have been rotating. Should I freeze the lane now? Hmm. 
Like normally you don't really freeze a lane like this in the middle because normally in the early slash mid game you lose lane pretty hard as a Nasus. So the fact that I'm winning the lane now is all, be all because of those early kills. I'm just gonna dive him again. I'm just gonna dive him again. We can kill him. Our bot lane is losing is losing hard though, so it's gonna be a little tough late game because our bot lane is losing incredibly hard. Oh no! So I have to go away. Nah, I'm dead. But the Shivana's here. Shivana can just clean up. They they both dived me hard, and now Shivana can just easily clean up. He should push my lane. <laughs> I'm just gonna let's flame these guys. Let's flame the bot lane. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, don't be toxic. Uh, this is just a little toxicity. Just a little bit. So, as I said, I'm going for the Spirit Visage now. By the way, Nasus in the late game is, like, the most fun thing to play. Uh, like, I'm serious. La Nasus in the late game is so amazing. Because of how tanky you are and how much damage you do. So, the main thing about Nasus is don't get destroyed in the early game, guys. Because I see so many Nasus players, they just go, like, 0-4 in the early game. And they feed the enemy Baron laner. And even when they get to their late game, it doesn't even matter anymore because, you know, because they're so behind. So I'm going to give you a tip on how to play against Nasus because there's many different things that you can do against a Nasus. So uh, freezing the lane is really, really good, especially if you freeze the lane like close to your side, because then Nasus cannot CS. Like if the Nasus tries to come close to the minions, you can just fight him and win. Every champion, like almost every champion wins a 1v1 against Nasus in the early game. So that's what you can do. And what you can also do is gank. Like you can freeze the lane. And then when the enemy is trying to, you know, when the enemy, when the enemy Nasus is trying to take the farm. Let's take the turret, by the way. Boom. When the enemy Nasus is trying to take the farm, you can just gank him. Like if the jungler is ready there, you can just gank him. Let's just fight him again. I'm just going to dive him again. Let's go. I can slow him anyways. He's just dead. I want to secure with my Q. Boom. There it is. Easy kill. I'm just dominating this lane with Nasus right now, honestly. I can get my Spirit Visage. Or Spirit Visage. Okay, another thing, guys. Are you are you looking at how I'm taking these minions? I want you to look at my stacks. Wait, oops, I just misclicked. This jungle camp, you know, the, the two minions that, that, that change... No! Ah, oh, of course, I missed it again. That change into all these other minions. This is the best thing for Nasus. You can literally get so many free stacks over there. Because you can just um, secure every single one of these minions with your, with your first ability. And get free stacks. So if your wave is pushed up. You know, if your wave is pushed all the way up. Let's be a little careful by the way. Then you can just get free stacks from these minions. And it just disappeared. Wow. <laughs> you can literally get free stacks. And you can get a lot of free stacks. Like a lot, a lot, a lot. So you have to utilize that. You know, did those me? I'm gonna. Should I help the dragon? I'm just gonna help dragon. I might lose my turret, but I'm gonna help them anyways. We should just wipe them out here. Let's go. I'm gonna help my team. He just used his ulti on 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 uh, Ari, which is fine. Yeah, he might get my turret. Uh, can we get the dragon, guys? Come on, I'm here. Just get the free dragon. Like it's worth my turret if we just get the dragon. We can easily fight this. That's why I'm here. That's literally the reason why I'm here. Shivana's gonna secure it with smite. Yeah, nice, okay. Yeah, as I said, I lost the turret, but whatever. We got the infernal dragon. It's totally fine. So, another thing. Just a general tip for Baron lane. Uh, when there is a dragon, it's really good if you, you know, if you help your team with it. Because that can literally mean... Uh, maybe your team would lose a 4v4, but if it's a... Oh, what are they doing? Let's teleport to them, help them. Come on. Oh, uh, no. Uh, ah, yeah, I yeah, screwed up. Uh, my joystick glitched. What? I'm lagging. No. I failed. I failed. I got... Ah, I got... At least I got that one. I... Uh, man, I had lag. Did you guys see that? I had like a lag spike exactly when I used my uh, teleport. Wait, what is happening with the chat? Can I type? Man, this Ezreal is so annoying. Yeah, I'm lagging. I think this is going to be a rough game, actually. It's good that we're taking dragons because we have no ADC in this game. We literally have no ADC. What was I talking about? Okay, so about the boots. Um, so in this game, I got teleport boots. And the reason that I got teleport boots is because I want to be able to be in my lane, to be farming in my lane. And when my team fights, I want to be able to teleport to them and help them immediately. 
Uh, now I filled that last teleport, of course, as you saw, which was a little, which was a little weird. <laughs> Wait, are they not? Are they fighting now? The bot pre? He's saying I'm solo player. <laughs> so teleport boots are also really good in a scenario where you want to be able to teleport to your team at any moment, you know, while pushing your lane. So at this point, I should be able to 1v2 a lot of the enemies because I'm just incredibly strong. I shouldn't die. We're against that Tristana though. He's Guardian Angel. I'm gonna fight him. Let's slow him. Boom. Okay. Okay, he just ulted me. Whatever. It's fine for me. Okay, let's farm. Secured with our Q. We, I have 236 stacks, 240 now, which is really, which is quite a lot actually. It's decent. The more stacks that you can get in the early game, of course, the stronger you'll get in the late game. Like that's the main goal of NASA's early game. Get as many stacks as possible. Uh, let's try to secure the turret. Oh, I didn't actually secure it. Yeah, it's easy fight. This is easy fight. We got this. Boom. Should I just dive them hard? I want to get the stupid guardian angel. Nice. Okay, let's walk away. I, I proc his guardian angel at least. He's following me. Uh, let's get this thing done. Boom. I was anxious. Oh yeah, I was talking. How do I turn that off? It's okay. Oh, easy dodge. Easy dodge, boy. Look at this healing though. That's all because of the spirit visage. Let's go in. No, I'm dead. Mm, I filled my flash. I wanted to flash over the wall, actually. And this Tristana is doing pretty well. Oh, of course he's doing well, because our bot laner is useless. Our bot laner is 1-7. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. Sometimes I just feel the need to be toxic. I am so sorry. Come on! Nice, Zio! Oof. Oh no, this is a problem. Like, of course, this is the problem when you help your team. If the enemy top lane or baron laner, I should say, if the enemy baron laner is still in the lane, um, he's gonna push turrets. I lost two turrets trying to help my team. And I want to say that the first turret was definitely worth it because I got my team a dragon. But the second turret was not worth it because we didn't get anything. Hmm, the dragon is up. I'm gonna be there again. I don't want to leave my team. I can get dead man's plate, but yeah, screw it up. Are they just gonna do dragon? Oh, I need to help them. Let's go. The Tristana, nice, he got him. Our jungler is doing really good, the Shivana. We can still win this game because the Shivana is doing really good. I'm doing good. So I have teleport. I, do I don't think they should engage. Like, why are they engaging? I'm ready to teleport if I need to. Evelyn is just pushing bot. Look at this Evelyn. Oh my god. Boom. I have 300 stacks now. These big minions give 8 stacks. Look, if I secure one. It's 8 stacks. So that's a lot of stacks. Let's go in. Let's just help them. I don't want them to lose. Oh god, he just died. He's just dead. Ah, uh, they're pushing, they're pushing side lanes very well. My boy Escobar is not having a good time. Wait, is that a free kill? Let's go in. Let's go in. I'm so tanky. Ah. Oh, I got killed. Rip, man. I don't know if that was worth it. No, that was not worth it. Shivana, man. He has a perfect score. He has a cloud dragon, that's why he can run away. Is he gonna make it? Yeah, he has a dragon that gives him movement speed. Is he gonna make it? Oh my god, keep running, boy! <laughs> oh, the Tristana's there too! Run, B! No! Hey, he's alive! And he got, he, he got the Tristana as well, oh my god! <laughs> and the Tristana's dead. Dude, this Shivana is such a legend. <laughs> Oh, 
Let me just get a guardian angel. Hmm. Shivana's 11-0. <laughs> He's doing really good. But the problem is, as I said, we don't have an ADC. Like, Ezreal is so useless that it's basically nothing. Their Ari is also pretty good. It's going to be a very interesting game. All I need to do is just dive in and tank everything and deal a lot of damage to their backline because I have so much damage now, actually. Wait, let's get this. And boom. That one also gives eight, eight stacks, by the way. I should easily be able to fight this Lee Sin. Easy peasy. There's an Evelyn. Free kill, right? Let's go. I got you, bro. I got you. I got you. The bot lane is pushing. This is our fight. We win this so easy. We have three dragons. I can just tank. Boom. Wait, what? Let's just kill them all. I'm gonna... Uh, should I dive? Yeah, I'm just gonna dive. Screw it. Let's continue. I'm gonna flash in. I got this kill too. Easy, man. Easy. Can we just finish straight up? I think we can just straight up finish the game. Let's push. Let's push. Let's push. Why Baron? Why Baron? Finish. Finish. Come on, Ant. Finish. Shivana. Hello. Shivana. Okay, the Shivana played really well, but this is a little weird that he's making this call. Just finish, bro. <laughs> All right. I hope this video helps you become a better Nasus player. I actually made another Nasus video. You can find a link to it in the description. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Let me see if my camera is working again. No, it's not working. So yeah, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next Wild Rift video. Bye-bye. <laughs>